My friends, it seems like social media has come to stay. It's a big part of our lives now. Talking Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, WhatsApp. You know, it's also becoming a tool being used to destroy things, destroy people, a tool of destruction. Recently, some folks put up a very scary and shocking video, uh, obviously with the intent to just destroy the image of my favorite malt brand. Um, now, I was initially in shock as they poured some liquid substance out of a can of Amstel Malta. Now, I was really, really shocked initially, but then after a second look, I had to ask myself some questions. Why was it that I couldn't see the faces of these people? And given that cans cannot be reused, how on earth did something like that get into a can? I just really had to ask myself, how come the movie makers just recorded with an open can of Amsterdam Motor? We didn't really see them open it, for instance. And then how did they even know that there was something inside since cans are not transparent why didn't he go back to the place where he bought the can and complain there instead he just went on to social media and broadcasted what is obviously a lie we need to really observe that they poured it into a bowl and not a glass like you would if you were going to drink Amstel Malta so really think about it and be less gullible as a Nigerian and don't be reposting things just because you saw them on social media from what you viewers can see now, as soon as you open a can of Amstel Malta, you hear the fizz, you see the gas, you see the foam, and when you pour it, it foams right to the top. Hopefully, you're not going to be as gullible as so many other Nigerians, and I'm going to be enjoying my low sugar Amstel Malta.